starting, right? Uh, yep. Red light. Yep. Red light. Right. I, see blink I see blinkies. Are you sure? Yeah, no, it's going. I see the red light in the back blinking. I think you should get up. All right, I'm getting on YouTube. We're getting close. <laughs> Coming in YouTube. Yeah, there, there it is. Real light. Right there. And there's Nick. Tapestry. There's me. YouTube. <laughs> hey YouTube. I'm Derek, certified bourbon steward. I'm Nick. I don't know. <laughs> the Fonz, I guess. Yeah. Nick, the certified hey. bartender. Hey. Um, <laughs> welcome back to just another obnoxiously crazy episode of Keeping It Neat with Derek and Nick. We're Derek and Nick. And if you've noticed, we have a smaller version of the large chug jug. The chuggy juggy is out today. Yeah. So we got something different in there. We did. It's doing a little something different. You know what we're doing. Blind taste test. Don't know what's in the can. The bourbon babes hit it out already. Already poured us a booze. So there it's out there right now. Our liquor sitting in our glasses. Abel's ready to take in the episode also. He's here. We've yeah. got our grading. Zero to five. Five being the best. Zero being the worst. This is a big episode. It is. Last episode was huge. We gave you oh, our, uh, was, we got our the... 50th subscribers. Yes, we did. Uh, so that was we big. finally made it. We made uh, it. We made it, YouTube. We're here. We, within two and a half weeks, almost three weeks now time, actually, we actually eight, had... Actually, seven episodes? Is that what it Yeah. Seven episodes. So. Seven episodes within three weeks. Um, we basically actually had a distillery reach out to us. Yes, we did. And they want to be our first donors. Donors. Our first donors. So again, donor we always we will accept anything. Uh, we are more than willing to try anything. It will not be a, hey, we get to know what this is. Again, it's going to go in the collection and our bourbon babes will handle it, which yeah. brings me to my next point, Derek. Bourbon babes. What about the bourbon babes? What there might be a special episode. There may up. be a special episode. You're going to get to see a behind the scenes episode before this one of how the mystery item gets into the can. Whether it's the small can or a big can, you're gonna to get to see that, we're gonna have that in there. You get to see the bourbon babes, they'll tell you all about it. Yep. They're gonna tell you how they get everything and what they do to select and put it in there. Unbeknownst to us, we have no idea. We stay out of the room, yep. we stay out of their way, they do what they do and they put it in here. They hide the notes in the little other envelope and they put the whatever we're drinking inside the can and we don't know what's going on. Yeah, you gotta just know, folks, this is the honor system. We're Watch our past episodes, watch yeah, actually the last episode, and you can tell how sometimes, actually not the last, two episodes two ago, episodes, yeah. with the, uh, that horse whisk, Irish whiskey, I mean, sometimes, <laughs> there you go, I'll never remember it, because it's not memorable, uh, but basically, Fair enough. Uh, but it is what it is, um, the fact is, is that this is the honor system, we are just being as truthful as we can be, and you just have to, you have to trust us, if you're going to be trust part us. of the kinfolk, you're going to trust us. It's you're going to subscribe. Trust. You're going to click down below. Right over by Nick. Yeah. There's a subscribe button down in. there. It's right amazing. There. I, I figured it out. It's you a lot it. coming to me. I, yeah. it, it did. You yeah. learned by the episode, and I'm proud of you. Yeah, thank you. I appreciate that, sir. I do. There's a lot of editing that needs to be done, and <laughs> let me tell you, I'm cutting through tape, buddy. Well, Derek, are you ready, Whiskey? Ready and able. Let's do it. Let's go. The tap, the official tap, it's, it's on. I have to. Ooh. Very light. Caramel. In there. A little bit of oak, maybe? Yeah, I'm going in. Mm. Now, I know that none of these Ooh. are chilled, but did you feel like it was cool on the first touch of your tongue? Uh, you know, that might like be almost, maybe a little, you think like a little mint in there, maybe? Getting you on the tongue? Now, in the mint, I'm talking just the, the temperature. Oh, the temperature of it? It was like oh. weirdly, like they're all kept at room temperature, but I felt like when you first. Oh, went, wow! All right. Well, it was cool, but I mean, that's the alcohol Whoa. in there, too. The alcohol evaporation causes cooling, so. We might be tricked with another rye going on. Oh. Because I just went I on a roller so. coaster. I just yeah, well, went. It's, it's actually right. delicious. It's really I good. I went from like almost a cold. It almost tasted like it was on whiskey rocks. So if you don't know what whiskey rocks are, they are special specialized little rocks that are you can keep in your freezer. I actually own many. Um, do you own any? I do have whiskey okay. rocks at home. And uh, they don't water it down and they keep it cool. So it's very nice to put in there easily, you just wash them under the sink, whatever, you throw them back in the freezer. Um, it, to me, when I first had it on my palate, it was cold almost, which is interesting right. because all of these are kept at room temperature. And then it's slightly warmed, and then there was that afterburn again, like last time, where it just like all of a sudden, like it felt like, like I'm becoming part of Game of Thrones. Oh, well, well, there you go, all right. Maybe I'll be in the show. 
maybe on the re the what is it the preseason? Yeah, they're gonna, the yeah, prequel they're or something. Prequels, yeah. the prequels of Game of Thrones coming. So what do you what what else are you feeling tasting? Because I I think the mint's in there. I do agree with you. I'm getting mm. a little smokiness in there. I'm getting smoky. The smell and the palate are so different. Yeah, no, the palate is totally different than what you're smelling. You're yeah. getting two different things. I definitely agree with you. Um, on the palate, I'm getting a light smoke in the back. I'm getting peat definitely on this one. Um, it's super light. It's not heavy. It's not overbearing. No, it's just that burn. It, it's totally it's out, smoky. I'm going to go. You're getting, you're getting some you're alcohol in there. You're barrel. Yeah, well, it's there's some barrel in there. You're getting a barrel. barrel. There's, there's some barrel in there. You're definitely getting that barrel in the background on it. Mm -hmm. Folks, going right into H2O, h 2 no. For me, for this one, um, I'm already going to tell you, I would go H2O. Only okay. because I, I don't like it up. I don't like yeah I don't like an over the top burn and I'm feeling that right now which means there's probably a high alcohol content in there yeah probably um, it's it's, it's going to be there I don't, I don't think it's as high as I think you're thinking no no, no not like that but yeah. I think it's I think it's still yeah though there is some uh, alcohol in there there's you mid get end it. I guess maybe. yeah probably mid um and I feel like the water is going to help okay. bring out the flavor a little Fair bit enough. more it won't hurt I I would go eight um me. I really, almost everything I drink, I really don't add water to it. I like to experience it as, you know, the distiller or whoever it is wanted it to be. Uh, so I really very rarely add water. Maybe a little spice pepper, maybe a little black pepper. Okay, I'll um, give you the pepper in the back. You think that maybe a little bit of tea? Black tea. Okay. A little? Yeah. I'm thinking. I, if I it's think not it's black, black pepper, then I could see black tea. Like it's. All right, I'm going to put down what my guess is for what I think we're working with here, and then we'll go into our grade. I think if you're ready for that, I mean, I don't want to rush you and feel if you, if you need I'm some intrigued. more, if you need some more uh, experimenting with your beverage. More. I right. think I'm. Want to go with it? Did you hear me say corn? By the way, what did you? I didn't hear you say corn. No, I missed that. I don't one. know. Sorry. Like I feel like it's more grainy. Like I saw maybe yeast. Like I feel like I'm out in the fields. In the fields with this one. Yeah, working it. Like long stocks of wheat. Okay. No, crazy. You wouldn't. Uh, right, like well, you know. Cow. I mean, I think you're. I think you're right because depending on what we're dealing with, you write down. You wouldn't be wrong if you're going with like a maltiness to it. Maybe malted. Like just a, mood. Just you did move. And if you heard the one of the episodes, the eagle rare one, when he, when he gave move the majestic call of the eagle, where patriots died all over the country. Yeah. Um, yeah it's it's, okay. Yeah, it's okay. It's all right. Uh, you can move away, buddy, if that's what you think. You know, cows are out there just reaping the wheat out there. But I think I'm actually going to be completely wrong. Okay. And when I turn this over, I'm actually going to write my second thought on the back because I have a backup. <laughs> I got backups. All if right, I'm not write my first, by the time my sixth one, I'm going to be correct. Go ahead. Spin right. it. I think it could be a rye again. A rye. Okay. And I think 42%. All right. No, no, 52. I'm sorry. I went with a scotch, and I spelt it right this time. Um, and it's 45% I'm going with for the alcohol content on it. And now... Yeah. We're going to go with our little chuggy juggies. And, uh, also, if it's not this, I'm totally not showing it. Try 52%. That, you're up there, boy. I, your... It's a burn for me. It's a weird Four, fluctuation. And five. So, yeah. where are you going with this? What are you feeling? Um, i got to say, I'm right back to, uh, yeah. No, I'm not going to give it. Two. Two. I still feel lost. Okay, I, well. I appreciate it. I like it. Mm -hmm. But I have to save my bigger scores for the ones I'm in love with, where I'm like, okay. yes. Like, and it makes me think about those other ones I've already done, and I'm like, there's some now that's that I almost want to add more to and go back, but we're not. That's it's yeah. in the moment. It's what we're thinking blindly. Yeah. That's and, the point of this podcast. I mean, I learned from the first Plot. episode we did when I went big out the gate. And, you know, I was, yeah, I was applause. way over the top. Applause, everyone. But yeah, I'm, gonna give go, it. I'm giving it a two and a half. Okay. Yeah, I was good. See, and I almost I like went it. two and a half. I know you were. You you were tottering yeah. on there. You were like, you were like, eh, no, I don't. But I'm gonna go two and a half on it. I liked it. Um, it has a lot going on for it. There's something yeah. going on in there, and it doesn't die right off. We've had the ones that have gone no. like bam and dropped off. This yep. one takes you through. Has a little. Has the ups and downs through it. The peaks, so, the highs, the lows. You're going in there. There's a there's a lot going on in this one. I think that. That's kind of, I've actually enjoyed this one, mm -hmm. even though my score doesn't reflect that. I'm finding that this one, it's going to grow on you, yep. and the more we sit and the more we sip, the more we're going to enjoy it. I think it's more of like what you're comfortable with drinking is where you go with it, you know, with the Again, not a first-time shower. No, no, no we're, gonna, we're coming out. Okay, what? well, there we go. we got a scotch, sir. 
You were right. I was right. Good yes. job. Thank you. Oh uh, my god, look how tiny it is! It is the tiniest <laughs> bottle of scotch. But we mentioned that too. We said if you're going to buy something and you're not going to really want to invest a lot into it, <laughs> buy small. And you can't get much smaller than this. No! No, this is okay, a 200 really, milliliter bottle. I, so when I saw this bottle, I, I haven't seen these yet. And I really thought the bottle was going to be like this Laying long, down sideways and a very in there. small cups or something. Okay, well, it's got rocks like, glass. Maybe like, you know, rocks little glass in there. We got one rocks glass. This is a party for one. No, I, one I love this. And I, I think you could actually even put two glasses in and put the, that small bottle in a glass. Well, you probably, yes, you actually you could. In. You could do that. You could, if you wanted yeah. to, you could actually You're going with like a little that. date, a yeah, little sip somewhere. Well, I don't think Why I've not? ever tried that, but we probably try it out. It'll work. It's just a matter of It's a matter of maneuvering. And See? Go, look at that. Wow, you just increased this. Look at that. From now on, the these will be sold with two went. rocks glasses. No, they're not. There's one. You want another rocks glass, buy it yourself. There's one coming with one. <laughs> so it's really So we get the, the Crag and More. Crag and More? This Crag and More, it's an Irish. Um, okay. I'm no, sorry, yeah. it's a Scotch. It's a Scotch. I said gimme, Irish. Gimme Ooh. more. Gimme, gimme more. more. Oh, it's got 40% alcohol, uh, 80, 80 proof, so it's only 40. So it's really light. <laughs> Some notes. I liked it. It that is a 12 very, year. 12 year. Okay. It is yes, a 40% alcohol, okay. which means I was way out of the ballpark. You were, like you, you, were, you were going high on alcohol. You did. I went 45%, so I, mean, I went high on it. And I and I was saying it was a scotch, and that's really high for you for a scotch. Yeah. So they, you're averaging like 43s. Yeah, I got, I got to figure out that alcohol content a little more. But it's a lot what's going on in the, in the glass. So yeah. So the distillery was uh, Cra Craig and Moore? Craig and Moore. Craig and, Craig and Moore. I, Craig you know, and I, I, I told one of my friends I was going to really crush the um, pronunciation. pronunciations. You should write like the like... Crack and Hyped more. Yeah, the whole, I, like how it's broken like, down. I had to break yeah. it down to one of my kids. Because they were really impressed with the Craig Craig Ellicky. Craig oh. Ellicky really crushed it out nice. there for the for our fans. Thank you. Nice. They, they like Subscribe. that. Subscribe. <laughs> Subscribe. Uh, parent company. We've heard them before. Diageo. Diageo. Yeah, they're big. They're big in the Scotch world. They they one of those. They own that fifty one percent share and everything. You know your stuff, my friend. Thank you. Uh, this is on the banks of a legendary salmon river. It's for many of the home of the definitive Speyside single malt Scotch whiskey, hugely complex, rich with la with layers of flavor and a whiff of smoke. Mm. The finish. Did we say smoke? We said it was definitely in a, in a we barrel. We said barrelly, so that was okay. that's. But, but, but you said smoke. I said the peaty smokiness yeah. to it. Yeah. Okay. So. History. It's a Scotch whiskey distillery situated in the village of uh, Ballandalic in Banchfear, Scotland. Ooh, that was pretty good. I don't know if that's right or not, but that sounded amazing. Hold on. Should I bring my hat? <laughs> so I'll also put a map so of fun. Scotland in here so you get to see where everything is. So somewhere in here, probably over us, where Nick is now, will be Scotland. It'll show you all the different I, I know. I want you to put it over my body. <laughs> I will. Maybe it'll be your head for the episode. Just see my legs. Yeah, just be his, it'll be the head for Scotland the episode. Scotland walked away. <laughs> I don't know what accent that was. It's a single malt scotch uh, made in Scotland, and it was distilled using a pot, sti uh, pot still distillation process used of mash of malted barley. Okay. So that, but see, that's what you said. You said you know out there in the fields with the cow, you know, just working the fields. I'm so giving myself credit. I will. I'll give you credit. Matured for it. in oak casks. Nice. Give it to me there we go. for at least three years and one day. Well, it has to be for to be considered a scotch. I, yeah, actually, I had a point. But they threw in the one day. I know. I know. The like the one day selling it. It's like I'm not gonna buy all. I had the one day. I'm in. That's it. One day sold. Get out there. Give me all of them. Not two. <laughs> not a, not, not three day days. Day. Not a month extra. One day. Okay. The appearance is gold, which obviously the nose is a combination of sweet floral fragrances, riverside herbs, and flowers with some honey vanilla. Okay. I didn't really smell much of any of that. No, yeah, but the thing is, is everyone like what they're saying you get out of it with the distiller's notes versus someone else's. Like everyone gets something different. So yeah. what I get, what you get, what they may get, our viewers is going to totally. be totally different. And what the distiller is trying to do, I mean, understand that the distiller is crushing it. You know, what I mean, he's trying to push something out that's you know going to be good for everyone. So yeah. it's to his taste buds basically, totally. and this is what he's saying is he's getting out of it. The palate. Which we spent the most time on. A strong malty taste yeah, okay. with hints of sweet wood smoke and sandalwood. There you go. That's now, sandalwood's like... an interesting one because I haven't heard that yet. And I know that that's a common The sandalwood, that's, that's but... the scotches. That's, that you're going to get that more in the. That, that scotches, maybe the Irishes, yeah. kind of that end of it. So you're not going to really get that in the bourbons. There's a lot of sandalwood in those. But... And again, the finish. Uh, long malt driven finish, light smoke, hints of sweetness. Okay. Where I think I was tasting yeah. a little bit of that sweetness. Price, guess? That, um, that uh, for a full now, size. Now, mind you, this yeah. is a 200 milliliter. So just this one. Guess this first. I don't know. I'm gonna say that's gonna be. I'm trying to think of like if you buy something behind the uh, behind the counter. Uh, 25 bucks. 21. All right. Good guess. 
Uh, and for the 750 milliliters, so the bigger bottle. Ooh, the bigger bottle. Oh, boy. I'm going to go, that's going to be like $60. That's the exactly on the knot. Oh, all right. Well, I don't know all right. if that's the same. Um, well, thanks now. for listening, folks. Uh, again, if you haven't subscribed, yeah, like, subscribe, here, share it everywhere. Tell everywhere. your friends. Comment any supportive, any non-supportive feedback. We always love any sort of any feedback. Any feedback. Just put your comments in. Doesn't matter. Yeah. They're good, the bad, and different. When yeah. you know, I don't mind you telling us to our faces. <sighs> I've had yeah. people tell me. Give a shout out, but Kayla, Is Kayla oh, commented. Yes. So I was sitting here for last. Oh, I'm sorry. We we love Kayla. We do love Kayla. Kayla's a she's close friend of ours. She is. More year. Well, I met her through you. Yep. Yeah, yes, you did. But in, she's a nice lovely lady. lady. Lovely lady. Lovely she lady. She gave us a comment. We told you. You comment below. We give you a shout yeah. out. She asked questions about the can, and you know, we I gave her a, a way yeah. to go for that for the Facebook page, and she, you know, to, how, to, how to find out more. So comments mm -hmm. work. We respond. We'll get yeah. back to you. Yeah. You know, so comment, and we'll get back to you. Um, but I think that's going to be about it for us, bud. Not like, much here. No, not much left to go no. with though. So you can take us out or. You got this in you? Uh, I can try it. All right. Let's hope for the best. I'm going to, here's hoping to you. No. Nope. No. Nope. See, I Already. can. This I'm going to look thing. at it. This will be in the beginning, <laughs> and then you'll find the real one at the end. Here's hoping that you find a little bit of luxury. In an otherwise ordinary life. I did it that time. You did. And I did look. It took me a second. Yeah. Bye, guys. <laughs> Bye, everyone. If you are ready and able to whiskey, be sure to drop a comment below. Hit those like and subscribe buttons, and press notifications. Also, follow Keeping It Neat on Instagram. Thanks for watching, kinfolk.